Hi everyone, it's Henry from How To Become and welcome to this video on the Northern Territory Police Tests in our Australian Police Testing Series. Let's begin. First a little bit of background on the Northern Territory Police. Police in the Northern Territory has existed since 1870 but the NT Police as we know it today was founded in 1911. In the past 50 years, the number of police officers operating in the Northern Territory Police has grown from less than 100 to over 1,300. It serves a population of 229,000, over a huge 1.3 million square kilometres, and is host to a number of specialist groups. Okay, so let's look at how Northern Territory Police test their potential recruits. The written portion consists of the following elements, a literacy test, numerical ability test and writing ability test. So these are the three areas in which Northern Territory Police are looking to assess their potential recruits. Okay. A literacy test could look something like this. Spelling could be tested in a number of questions. So please look at the following questions and answer them below and we'll mark them at the end. Okay, number one of the four options, which is the correct spelling of the word improvements? Number two, which is the correct spelling of the word commitment? Okay, let's move on to number three, which is the correct spelling of the word representatives? And then number four, applications. Now feel free to pause the video and go back if you feel like you'd like some more time and put down your answers and we'll go through them at the end. Okay, numerical ability test, the questions could look like this. Number one, a charity arranges a bike race, 120 people take part, one third of the people finish the race in under half an hour. How many people did not finish the race? in under half an hour. So write down your answer. And question two, in the following diagram, which is the missing angle, uh, which is represented by the letter B? Okay. Three to six. What is two sevenths of 490? Divide 49 by 7 and then multiply that by 12. Multiply 8 by 9 and then divide it by 2. And subtract 14 from 92 and then multiply it by 2. Okay. For the writing ability test, you'll often be asked to draw up a full crime report. So, in a test you might be presented with a short description of events that have taken place at the scene of a hypothetical crime and then it's your task to write up a full crime report of the incident. The aim of this test is to assess your ability to present information clearly, accurately and concisely and uh, it's often done in the context of police work so mostly the incident, incident you have to write up will be a police matter. For you to properly get to grips with this question please follow the link in the card above to our website where you'll find a blog in which we explain the writing test. It'd be easier for you to have a look at a sample answer and sample question there rather than in a video. Okay, so let's look at the answers for the questions you did answer. The correct spellings are as follows. So check you got the right spelling of improvements, commitment, representatives and application. And the numerical ability test, uh, number one is 80 people, did not finish the race in under half an hour. And number two, uh, the missing angle was 100 degrees, because of course angles on a straight line add up to 180 degrees. The answer to question three was 140, four was 84, five was 36, and six was 156. Okay, so that's the video. Thanks for watching, and I hope you learned a lot about the Northern Territory Police Tests. For much more information on this, including advice on the whole application process, 
please follow the link on screen for our website. If not, check out the playlist where you can find other videos for other states and their police tests. See you in the next one.